redemption I will never let you down Will it ever get done to you, I wonder What's up, PJ Trucking? Dude, come on, give me one of those. No, don't put the camera on it now. What's up, PJ Trucking? Dude, today we have a 2023 F-250. It's the first one we've ever had on the channel in a little while since they've came out, but we haven't had a review on one of them. So today we got you guys a 2023. It's Colin Davis. You guys have seen him on the channel before. And another truck, I'll pop it up here. And dude, now we got a 2023. All right, so obviously, guys, you see this 2023 F-250 behind us in its stock form. This truck is going to get lifted. He's going to do some pay match. We'll get him to talk a little bit of what his options and what he's going to do to it. Um, it's actually going to go to Poppy's Garage to get a lift kit, so PJ will probably film a little bit of that as well. And you guys will see a truck a week when the truck is finished. So right now, we have the 2023 F-250. This is a So right off the bat, the first thing that's changed since the 2022 is the grill. Everyone's always been talking about what what everyone thinks of the headlights and the grill. Um, it's kind of grown on me, for one. The headlights, well, now the new 2023s, they basically come as the old trucks used to come ultimates. So this truck is optioned with uh, C-bars um, as well. He has the 360 cameras all the way around. Um, Even though it's not an ultimate. Yeah, so this is a factory option and basically just a base lariat. So before on the 22s, it was an upgrade that you kind of had to add on, but now they just come with it. So like we're saying right off the bat, we have the new grill with the new headlights, way different front end, got new fog light bezels. And dude, this isn't like a 2023 walkthrough review video, but dude, we're the first one we got in the shop, so I don't know, man, we're just checking it out. I'm gonna repeat a bunch of stuff everyone's probably ever seen. <laughs> uh, obviously the bumpers are different so the headlights so this truck could have been optional yeah, the set. sick headlights they're actually new they go in the back now no <laughs> dude, dude my bad my bad i don't do lighting man hit up so for retros wait so these are halogen taillights um they could be option as led as well maybe pj will put a clip of what those look like um so we do got the bed step another different type of thing that's done most of you guys see the videos of me tearing down the rear axles something that this stuff does have is electronic rear parking brakes. So this will be way different when we do disassembly on the rear ends. Um, for the most part, the hitch receiver has a little bit of a change. The leaves are the same. The axle base is basically the same. Drive shaft, the drive train is pretty much the same. Um, the handles are different. And also the bed steps. Um, obviously, you guys might like them, might hate them, we don't know. But, so a little bit different on the interior. Obviously, the whole front dash system. Um, I mean, I don't really <laughs> know. Good, I don't really know. Video you're ever gonna watch, bro. Dude, this is the best 23 review video. For change, dude. Intro, the best 23 walkthrough video you've ever watched, bro. So this is a 6.7. It's the same motor. Uh, you could get the high output version that everybody was talking about. How the badge is red. My boy Colin didn't get the high output version. Dude, we need you in here, man. We need the customer, bro. Yeah, we need yeah, some. We need some uh, customer what's, review, what's bro. Know about it? I mean, Dude, you tell us where you, bro. And you work at a dealership. It's sell me, it's sell me this pen. Sell me this pen. Pretty much just an uglier version of a twenty-two. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Dude, great, bro. Everybody's comment. Everybody. <laughs> Dude, all right, man. What made you get this twenty-three? Um, honestly, because my they switched my twenty-two order to a twenty-three. That's, imagine you click this 23 video and <laughs> that's what the customer review says, bro. He actually wanted the 22. He really did want a 22. What, what are three things that you hated on it before you had it? And now you have Before I had like, it? The front end grow, has grown on me a lot. Um, the fact that the 360 cameras and a lot of the options you have to get in the Larry Ultimate, you get in the base model Larry in this. Um, like what? 360 cameras, the 12 inch screen. Well, no, the 12 inch screen comes in the base Larry, doesn't it? Yeah, no, no. Yeah, okay. So, oh, heating and cooled seats, rain sensing windshield wipers, because it always rains in fucking Florida, and I think that's it. See the fender badges, humongous change. Big ass fucking fender badges, side steps. Um, I'm not a big fan of the tail lights. Ugly ass stocks. Dude. Yeah, those things are gnarly. Dude, can we get, can we, sh can we see you use the bed step real quick? I mean, we need something for today's video. Or did this for the customer base, instead of using your tire, which probably just adds another five inches, right? If you got low legs, you could just climb up in here and I could grab this water bottle that my, my friend decided to throw in my bed and I could just toss it out. Obviously, that's a really good help. Does it? Yeah. Dude. And they color match the, uh, the color match the hand. What's the name? 
the belt. Oh yeah, the pay and match. So they're basically, totally they're blowing yeah. every every pay match guy. They're gonna blow you guys out of water. 2024s, I heard, yeah. full pay match. Full pay match. Bro, I can't believe this, dude. They have a measuring tape on bro, the show. Bro, so if you're a big fisher bro. guy. And no, a bottle bro. opener. You need a beer? Right oh. there. Dude, don't tell Chuck that, bro. <laughs> oh, Chuck's like, let me put an order in, bro. Totally, like, we... <laughs> bro, bro, I wonder dude, if you could I was ahead of my time, truck. bro. All right, man. So you guys see the headlights. Dude, the humongous sea bar on the Lariat. The grill kind of goes into the headlights. I know this is the biggest controversy everybody's been talking about. Dude, this front end needs some serious help, honestly. If you're gonna build these trucks, there's been a lot of builds already. There's been a black. Obviously, the first one that was ever built like was insane. It was a black F-250. I'll pop it up here. And now, obviously, some time has passed, so there's been a few white ones. I'll pop up some clips here. But, dude, this front end really needs some serious help when you're building these. I, dude, I don't know, man. I feel like something that's going to be coming back or making a popular flex is like a black girl into a white paint match headlight. I'm dying to see a paint match headlight in person. Man, on the inside we have the big screen. Dude, I'm really, I'm not that guy that just does the quick reviews like, oh, all these buttons, bro. I just know way different than a 22 interior, digital dash display for the gauge cluster and then the 75th anniversary radio. Hey man, so this truck actually has a crazy plans with Poppy's Garage. You guys have seen us go over there. It's actually gonna get fully built by Poppy's Garage. Eight inch radius arm kit, um, powder coated pink, I guess. More pink than purple. <laughs> Dude, bring out the swatches, bring out the swatches, man. What do you got, what do you got? It's like in between these two. So it's got more of this color, but more flake like this. So it's gonna have frame overlays for poppies, the new radius arms, uh, traction bars, um, doing 26 by 16 American Force Genesis on 35, 1550s, I think. What time? I don't know yet. Oh, 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 oh dude, we did. Bro, this guy, you smiling like that right there, bro. <laughs> bro what, is, what is he running right now? What is he running right now? What are you running right now, dude? That's a great point. We didn't get into this, bro. <laughs> right now, dude, he's got the duelers. All terrain. <laughs> Bridgestone duelers, man. On the sick Lariat. Stocks, man. And things are hard. They're hard? Yeah. Maybe for sale. Maybe. I don't know. Bro, maybe. maybe for, yeah, no. I'm going to run Fury. Or I have Furies right now, but I'm thinking about going to Venom. I don't know yet. We'll see. Tough. Depends. Tough, man. Yeah. Tough. How come? <laughs> I just wonder. Bro, it's I know. I, it's dude. You if I do, if I well. do 35s, it will most likely be Venoms. If I do 37s, it's going to be Furies. Why not 35 Furies? Mine PJ. leak like a. Bro, fire. I was wondering, bro. About they sell the time knows, on the road. Like, mine leak like a sieve right now. No, wait, you, not the Furies. No. <laughs> Impossible. Hey, bro. PJ's gonna put a picture of Venom blown up. Right, <laughs> With bubble up. Alright, man. Dude, I'm just saying. Yeah, it's true. This is our first customer. Alright, man, we're gonna get a sound clip on a stock 23 F250. What do you think, Joey? Bro, let's hear what it sounds like. <laughs> well, it's on already. <laughs> It's on, we missed the on. Push in air, man. We're just pushing air. Dude, it's too loud in the shop, bro. Alright, All right, so hop it in. Dude, the interior's kind of fire, bro. The interior's nice. So I personally like it a little bit more than the 22s because they 22s have that hump here over the screen, and now they made the whole Cluster digital, so that's pretty cool. You can switch all your gauges and all that. Um, as far as the center screen, it's like the same thing as the 22. There's not really much difference. Right. And then you have 360 cameras on this one. Yeah. So go here. left. Go left. I'm gonna stop real quick. I'll show you. All right. So you have 360 front facing, and you have, I believe this is the bed camera. Back up. And then my hit just my hitch receiver's off because it's getting powder coated. Oh yeah. And then oh, and then your side mirrors. Oh, the side it's, view is fire. It's tr kind of trippy when you're driving with it. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Alright. And the, dude, the front view one is hard, like especially is, once you lift it. Dude. Yeah, I know. But I wish I could drive with it. I think it cuts off after you know, oh. 25 miles an hour or something like that. Not even. Oh yeah, it's gone. It's gone. 
Dude, it, how's the audio in this thing? Still the same? Uh, yeah, it's pretty shitty compared yeah. to all the other manufacturers. It's not the best. I'm probably gonna switch the door speakers out. I have four tens I'm gonna put in in a MTI acoustic box. And then, yeah, that's pretty much all I got planned for it on the interior. Everything else is exactly the way I want it. Alright, alright. Well, obviously, you guys won't hear anything. It's completely stock. And we're pulling up to the hill. Dude, what do you think, man? This shit's a lot steeper in person than it is in video, man. I'm not gonna lie to you. Dude, we're about to hit it. We're climbing to 23, bro. All right, man. This is the first 2023 on the channel to do a hill climb. Two wheel drive, can't she survive? 2023. Oh, dude! Cannot survive, bro. Oh, dude, it is sitting lower than the 22s. Get on the less deeper side. Bro, let her eat, let her eat. Watch the valence. Bro, what? Two wheel drive, she cannot survive. Bro, the valence, bro. So what do you have on now? All right, so right now it's still two wheel drive, but his lockers are on. I feel like it might be the difference. Third try. Dude, this thing can't make it up the hill. What? <laughs> oh, dude, and it sits so low that that front valence is just needed. All right, we're actually about to do the first four wheel drive hill climb because it really can't make it up. Four wheel drive. All right, it's up, man. Four wheel drive, she's alive. Dude, that's with the lockers, four wheel drive with lockers. Bro, what the, dude. That's nuts, that's hey, nuts. Also wet. Else does that oh, actually solid point. Yeah. Solid point, it is raining. That is a good point. Shit's slick. All right, fair enough, fair enough. We'll run it back yeah, one day. You gotta hit it for round two. <laughs> I need redemption. So right here, man, we got a 2022 build. So you guys will see the full video. Bro, so what do we got going on? So we got a black 22 platinum. Uh, this truck's going on a 14 inch PMF. Coilover kit is obviously. Um, it's got buckets, cross member, weld on trusses. So we got this bucket a little bit cut up. We took the axles to get, we'll get welded. So maybe when they'll come back, you guys will see that too. Yeah. All right guys, short video. We had a few things planned for the 23, but the weather didn't hold up. We are gonna have him in particular back on the channel soon. Comment what other 2023 models of trucks you guys would like to see. Appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe. We got some sick videos coming up. PJ Trucking.